Okay, this is take two of Comet C24, C2014 Q2 in the constellation Aries, <clears throat> also known as Comet Lovejoy. We're seeing it through Gen 3 thin film image intensifier in essentially real time. Um, the camera is a Sony A7S camera connected to the back of the intensifier via an InVision optics relay lens. It's very windy tonight at Mount Pinos, California, so you might hear some blustering wind or maybe maybe you won't even hear me because the wind's so darn loud. Settings on the camera, 1 15th of a second shutter, ISO is 1600. The lens in front of the intensifier is a Zeiss 200mm f2 lens running at f2. And you got a nice bright comet in the center of the screen and if you look carefully you can kind of just barely make out a tail running to the upper left in the 10 o'clock direction. Very tenuous tail, but I think I see one. Not too bad looking. That's pretty much impossible to see without uh, some sort of amplified light vision device. Because I believe me, I've tried. And the only way I could get it was with stills with a conventional camera, like the A7S, for example. But that is a pretty nice shot of the comet, which is getting kind of low in the sky. Man, I wish this I would have had clear skies a week ago. But it was pretty hazy here and had very little luck. But this is nice, except uh, the comet's only about 30, 25 degrees off the horizon, so it's getting low and it's going to hit the tree line a little bit. So she'd be better if she was higher in the sky, but this looks pretty good, actually, I would say. So, Comet Lovejoy in Aries from Mount Pinos, California on January 24th through Gen 3 Night Vision. That is a wrap.